Hey y'all. So it is currently probably like 12.02, September 8th. And I'm having pain. I couldn't even sleep, I had to get up. Like I tried to sleep, I tried to lay down, but I was feeling feeling like the little pains. I really couldn't tell if it was Braxton Hicks or if it was um, contractions or not. Cause they not that, they, they really, really far apart. So they not close. They not as painful, but it's just like, I'm not able to sleep right. I'm not able to get comfortable. Right now I'm having, I'm having something. I don't know what the fuck this is. But shit. <sighs> I go to the doctor tomorrow to see if I dilate it anymore. And then, um, yeah. I'm trying to get some rest because I still got to go to work today. I got to be up in the next six hours. That's shit. I don't know what the fuck this pain is right now. It's not excruciating. Like, I'm a motherfucking G. I can take this shit. But, um, I just need to get some rest. I need to get some more rest. Because I know it's pain. I can feel it. But it ain't, you know, hurting, hurting like that. And then I got pressure in my twat. If y'all don't know what a twat is, it's my coach. I'm just playing. <laughs> Let me stop. But, yeah. I'm going to keep y'all updated. Try to keep, I'm going to try to keep y'all updated every day. Until my water break. Okay? So, today is the morning time of September 8th. And then we're going to take y'all to my doctor's appointment September 9th, which is Friday. But, um, uh, I'm going to go try to get something to drink. Hopefully my water is froze a little bit. And then try to lay back down. But I'm going to try to get some rest so I can get ready for work tomorrow. That's a, that's a that's a different type of pain. I'm trying to figure it out. No, that ain't another contraction. No. I know the difference between contractions. That that might be a Braxton hit. That might be, yeah. I think that one is a Braxton hit. Uh huh. No mucus plug has came out yet. But, uh, yeah. Okay. Hey, uh, so. Oh. It's September 9th. It is 3.30 in the morning. I've been up since, uh, 2.19. Um, because I can't sleep. I'm not in pain or nothing. It's just when he moved, it hurt. It hurt real bad, so. I'm just up. I ain't got to be up until 6. I might end up just taking, like, a little nap before it's time for me to get up to get the kids ready for school. But this is just an update of how I'm feeling before I go to my doctor's appointment. I got to be at my doctor's appointment at 8.30. And then I got to get my hair done at 9.30. And then I could chill for the rest of the day. So... Yeah. Alrighty, so we are on our way Oops. to the doctor's appointment. Second floor, and we're going up. I could barely fit anything. There go daddy. Huh? 
Okay. So this is how big I am right now. I'm about to get, see how big he is and then see how many centimeters I have dilated. So, yeah. So just waiting, just waiting. I'm about to get checked. Hopefully, I'm like three centimeters, maybe. If I'm three centimeters, then he'll probably come next week. <laughs> Normally, she'll come right in, but. It's like me a minute to come. Still waiting. It's about to be nine o'clock. My appointment's at nine thirty. to go check to see what's taking her so long. I'm already ready to go to get my hair done. So now I'm back at home for my appointment. And she said that I'm not dilated, nothing else. Um... I haven't dilated anymore, so I'm still like a centimeter and a half or one, yeah, whatever she said. Um, and then uh, she said that I was measuring 42 weeks. Baby was measuring 42 weeks, even though I'm 38 weeks. Um, also, he's nine pounds. She asked me, did I want my membrane swept? I said no. But then she said that she was going to be out for the for next week so even if i even if she did sweep my membrane what if i would have went into labor next week make it make sense but at this point i just want a new doctor for real to be honest with you um since when was y'all not able to record your delivery because I see plenty of people recording their delivery. I understand you can't record the staff, but since when you can't record delivery, that's why I'm like, where's this policy saying that? Because I want the policy. I want to see the policy. For real. But other than that, I'm going to keep y'all updated. So this is how I look. After getting my hair done, she's not with the color. She definitely stopped with the color. I was definitely having contractions while I was sitting in the chair, but... Yeah. So today is September 10th. He moving a lot. I'm cramping just a little bit in my twat. Um I just got done dancing. And uh Last night I was cramping too because I had some um, pineapple. But people was telling me to eat the core. If I can't chew on food and swallow it, I don't want to eat it. What's the point of me eating the core? But a doula said that if you eat the core, it helps. So I got 13 days left before he get here. But I'm just chilling. I was chilling yesterday and today. And then I go to work tomorrow, so I'm gonna still keep y'all posted. So right now, I'm just bouncing on the ball to get open by Tuesday. Or um, yeah, because I go back to my doctor's appointment on Tuesday. 
And then I'm about to go get me something spicy to eat. Because I want something spicy. For what reason, I don't know. But somebody did say eat something spicy that it uh, help induce labor too. So I'm going to try to go find something spicy. I'm like, how, how spicy? Shit, because I eat hot stuff all the time. Like, hot fries, hot puffs. Like, so I think I'm going to give me, like, some spicy chicken with some french fries and a cold drink. And some ice cream and probably, like, a, a cinnamon apple pie. Yeah. I should go to Mission Barbecue and get some corn, but I don't know. We'll figure it out. So I had to come to Upper Yard because I heard that they got some good food. So let's check out the menu. We got people that been here for 45 minutes already. It is juking, juking. Oh, I'm ready. I'm geek. I got my food, yay. Ooh, and I got some sauce. Okay, so let's see what it is. Let's see what this food do what it do, okay? Oh, and I got a Jamaican drink. So we're going to see how that is on some ice, okay? Oh, my goodness. This look good. Let's just take a taste. Mm. Okay. Yeah. I'm already digging into it. Yeah. Mm. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. We're going to... We're gonna have to come back for part two, okay? Okay, we back with part two. And I'm putting this over some ice. This is a Jamaican drink. Oh, that tastes like real fruit punch with a hint of coconut. But when I tell y'all this jerk chicken, hold up, because I already tasted that. Oh my god. That's the cabbage. This the curry chicken. And I got white rice. You should put sugar on the white rice. You find it. You find it eating it. This is good, y'all. Amazing. So it is September 11th and I just got off work. I'm about to take a hot bath because I'm sore. And then I'm about to eat my soup. About to heat up my cheese with my uh, meat. Put it back on the bread. Got it from uh, Jersey Mike's for to eat it with my chips and some juice and a cookie. They tell you not to take a bath, but guess what I'm doing? I'm taking a bath because I'm sore as fuck. All right, um, I'm gonna get out in like 30 to 45 minutes because then my back could be straight. Because right now I'm feeling great, okay? Um, I go to work tomorrow, it's gonna be 11 days tomorrow, and then Tuesday I go to my doctor's appointment. So, y'all gonna come to my doctor's appointment with me again to see what's going on. This time, my doctor's appointment is 45 minutes. Last time my doctor's appointment was only 15, not even 15, but they said it was 15 minutes. It was only like five minutes. So we're gonna see why this doctor's appointment longer than what it's supposed to be. But um, I'll be 39 weeks by Tuesday. So she might wanna sweep my membrane, but I'm gonna say no. Cause we could wait until 40 weeks. Uh, and yeah. But anyways, before I got cut off, like I was saying, yeah. Um, I don't understand why this appointment is 45 minutes long, but we gonna see why. But, um, I'll be 39 weeks, like I said before. And then, um, by 40 weeks, if he don't come on the 30th, no, if he don't come next week on the 23rd, then I still got September 30th, but then I can wait until I'm like 41 week, 42 weeks, which will put me at... October 4th and I think that's what he's waiting for but we gonna see okay so now that I'm out the tip most of the time it'd be hard for me to figure out which shirt of daddy's I want to wear like but this time it wasn't even that hard to pick because it was right on top <laughs> but uh I'm about to enjoy my food 
and then I'll let y'all know how tomorrow go. And then we gon' y'all gonna go to my doctor's appointment with me on Tuesday. Okay? This is what I'm about to eat. Mm-hmm. Jersey Mike Club. Bacon lettuce. Tomato. Cheese. Provolone cheese. Turkey. Ham. Mayo. Oregano. Oil. With the mixed chips. The Doritos. And the uh, ruffles. That good old double chocolate chip cookies. And some orange juice. Okay. So today was a long ass day. And I felt like I wanted to make today my last day. Because it was that motherfucking long. But anyways. Um, man. I am sore. I am really sore. I go to the doctor tomorrow. Y'all gonna come with me. Um, today is September 12th. I got 11 more days. And right now I'm relaxing with my diffuser. With the peppermint scent inside of it. And it smells so good. From Tranquil Serenity. So I'm relaxing with that right now. Um, after I'm done with that, then I'm going to bounce on a ball for a minute. And the next video you see is of me going to the doctor. And I'm not going to get checked again because I ain't got time. No, I'm not going to get checked again. Um, after I'm done visiting her, then I have to go um, speak to the labor and delivery manager and her boss, I think. And then after that, then I go back to work. So, uh, I'm going to just keep y'all updated. Alrighty. So, today is day 13. And I'm still pregnant. <laughs> um. <laughs> no. Exactly. So, now we're about to go to my doctor's appointment. See what it do, what it do. Then I'm going to work. So I am here at my doctor's appointment. I gotta wear a mask when I come in, but then I could take it back off after that. But we're gonna see how much he weigh, how big, how big he got. See if I got if I, if I dilate it, and then I'm gonna get a letter letting them know when my last day of work is. So then I could just chill at home. But I'm going to keep y'all posted. So this is how I look. Going up to the second floor. And I got to pee too. So I know they're going to want me to get like a urine sample. But this is my belly urine. And my back is killing me. Like shit. Honestly, I don't even know how I'm going to get my hair done. I think I'm going to just keep it like this. Shit, or I'm going to just snatch this shit off and wear my Cleo my braids. But here we go. So I know I'm not tripping. My doctor's appointment say eight o'clock. And ain't nobody in there. Today is the 13th. My appointment was at eight o'clock. So we're gonna feel. Let me call somebody. We in. It's September 13th. Y'all, I am so excited. <laughs> I am so happy right now. But for real, like, okay, so I went to my ultrasound. I met with my new doctor because my old doctor is out for five weeks and I'm due next week. <laughs> but anyways, she was cool. She measured me. He measured in 44 weeks. And I am three centimeters. I am three centimeters, Joy. And, oh, I'm open. This twat is very much open. I got seven more centimeters to go. Okay? But, anywho, um, his heart rate is amazing. Okay? He big as fuck. Mm -hmm. But I don't think he gonna be uh, as big as Fatty Guy. Now, if he 10, 8, he got fatty guy B. But other than that, after I was done with my appointment, I had to go to labor and delivery to meet with the manager and um, the other assistant. And it went really, really nice. Like, they wanted to make sure that we was on the same page. We went over, like, um, 
my birthright plan and stuff like that. And we were basically on the same page. And I'm glad that they were able to tell me, okay, so it isn't a problem that you record. You can record. But if nurses come in and say that, that they don't want to be recorded, are you um, able to not do that? Hell yeah, I can respect you. I'm going to respect you. But I'm glad that you are honest to, enough to tell me that I can still record my birth because who the hell telling me, who the hell going to tell anybody that they can record their birth? Now, I knew that you couldn't record the staff. I knew that. I knew that off the bat. I'm not dumb. Before you sit here and lie and say, oh, no, you can't record your birth because the staff is still going to be in it. No, you're not. My husband going to be on one side and my mama going to be on the other side. So we just was going over my birth plan. Um, they was letting me know um, that we were all on the same page and stuff like that. And I'm just so excited. <laughs> and then they took me to uh, room number seven to show me how I can do like my natural um, birth and stuff like that. I won't necessarily be uh, have to be hooked up to um, the monitors for them to like keep monitoring me. It'll be like um, Bluetooth or something like that. But I could always, you know, take it off. Um, I told them that when baby head is coming out, I do not want them to be putting their fingers all in my twat to try to stretch out my pussy. Uh-uh, we're not doing that. He gonna come out, he gonna shoot out. I think he gonna shoot out. I already told him that. I said, so what if, you know, my water break and he just come out? They said they just gonna have to watch him for 48 hours because I'm supposed to get like some type of IV um, and uh, for group we strip. So other than that, baby gonna be good. Baby gonna be good. It's almost that time, y'all. It's almost that time, y'all. I'm scared. I'm scared as fuck. Oh, Lord. It's about, to, it's about to happen. It's about to happen. All righty. So, uh, this is it. This is it. The next video that y'all gonna get is him coming out the twat. Him coming out the twat. He gonna be one years old. I'm just playing. But other than that, thank y'all for watching the, the vlog and stuff like that. Make sure you subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so you can know when baby about to come out this twat. Okay? When he slide out like Superman. I got it right this time because I said Spider-Man before. But anywho, yeah. Now I'm about to get ready to go to work. Yeah.